Hey yo, RV, welcome to the reaction video, guys. And today we are going to check out a brand new music video teaser that has been released for Red Velvet's upcoming comeback with their song Birthday. Based on the, uh, on the title, this is going to be the only teaser that we're going to get. So, guess what? Further ado, let's jump right into it and let's check it out together. In three, two, one, let's go! Okay. Okay. <laughs> Wait. Uh, so, okay, so the magic continue. Okay. We're going to watch it multiple times. There's already so much happening here. God damn it. Okay. <laughs> we will have to step through this later, guys. Okay, they all have weapons. That much I was like, oh shit, yeah, they have. Did she play rock, paper, scissors with, <laughs> with like Mr. Scissor hands there? He hates that game, I think. <laughs> I think he absolutely hates that game. Okay, I, we have two baseball bats. We have like... A grenade, if I'm not mistaken. Did Wendy have a grenade? Like a grenade is not really a, the, that the most handy weapon, I would say. But really effective for the ranged. Combat. At least mid-ranged combat here. No, okay, no, we have a lot of grenades. The sound of the song mm. is quite interesting. <clears throat> it almost sounds a bit like... Wait for it. Here. It sounds a bit malfunctioning at times, if you know what I mean. Okay. This is definitely going to be on the crazier side. In terms of both concept and song. The poor Cyclops. They're happy with... Did they play like Monopoly? What? They have so many questions. Okay, let's pause it a bit here. So we can like figure out what the hell is going on in all of this. Okay, so we have the girls approaching the Cyclop dude here. I guess he's supposed to keep intruders out. Check invitations and stuff like this. Okay, Irene got the knuckles. Sulgi got the freaking chain. Is it the chain from 28 Reasons? Is it the chain from 28 Reasons? It could be. I mean, SM, everything is kind of connected now. It could be. It could be. And I mean, the magic... That we see here, we also already know from Queendom. The grenades, the baseball bats. Didn't we have baseball bats during. Was it Bad Boy? Then we got definitely the money guns. <laughs> but I don't see the money guns here. So I guess we have three grenades. Okay, here we can see the weapons. Okay. Joy and Yeri got the baseball bats. Silgi got the chain. Wendy has her grenade. And whatever that is, a little black cat. I they, okay, they all got the animals. They all got the animals. But not the representative... representative I'm sorry, I just woke up. Oh, once. Irene is the one for the really close combat. Holy shit. Sulgi will first beat you and then strangle you or enslave you. Maybe enslaving. They all got like the military um, pattern going on here. Oh, by the way, what the hell is going on here? Is this a bear? 
Is this like a gingerbread house? Didn't we have something like this back in Peekaboo? You know where Joy is crawling over the floor? Isn't there a house like this in front of her? And I mean, Red Velvet had multiple, um, like, sweets um, themed concepts. For example, a cookie jar and stuff like this. And what the hell is going on here? Now suddenly the walls are covered with fur? I guess? Yeah, she's really playing rock, paper, scissors with this person. But I want to see where she's standing there. On a giant chessboard. Giant chessboard. Styling, by the way. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. She's obviously beating him. Right? I wonder for what reason. To pass, maybe? It's not like they're um, in a chess piece formation here, because look the way they're standing. They're standing, like, in the middle of the uh, tiles. So that's not it. They're getting a key. Wait a minute. Do we see from what they're getting a key? No, we don't. But it is white and fluffy. Maybe a giant bunny could be. By the way, I love the way Wendy is looking at the key. Like, it is the one thing she has wanted for her entire life. <laughs> They're all so happy here. Look at this. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Soul. It looks a bit like Monopoly, but the fields don't don't um, add up like that come before and afterwards. This is not it is a classic. They arrived in Seoul. They arrived in Seoul, and they're really happy about that. Somehow, when I feel like, think about about them arriving in Seoul, I have to think of like um, Oompa Oompa, you know, at the beginning when they're driving with the car. It's the first thing that pops into my mind. Okay, and Mr. I guess gingerbread guy isn't happy about it. Holy shit, okay. We got Mr. Nightmare Bunny here, who I assumed would like give the key. To the girls? I could be wrong there. This is creepy as fuck with the scene here. Holy shit. Happy birthday. Who has... Whose birthday? Gingerbread man? The person in front of gingerbread man? Or someone completely else? Or the girls? Man, they look more like intruders in this world. And he is not happy about it. He's really not happy about it. Let's listen a bit more to the song. I really like the fact that they don't just have like a regular bats. No, they got the enhanced ones with spikes. Around it. And barbed wire and stuff like this. By the way, did I already mention that I hate this at the end? This terrible SM sound, this... I hate it, so annoying. They threw the, the key Ooh. like they're... Like it's the playing piece on... S on Soul. Well, the Cyclops guy really didn't put up much of a fight. Same with Mr. Scissorhands. And I really have to say, if this is like the best this dude here can do with his army... He may want to overthink the choice of his employees. <laughs> like, they don't even need to use their weapons.
And it looks like Joy is playing hide and seek with someone. Maybe hide and seek is um, the game that they play to win the key. It looks like besides this dude, they're always playing games to go past or win something. What the hell happened? Wait a second. What exactly is this supposed to be? Is this a cane of some sort? A phone! That could be a phone. This is his cane, this is a phone. And he's currently... He's sitting at a like birthday party and now he's getting um, the call from one of his many failed employees and that the girls got past a certain checkpoint and then he here, he's strangling the phone and BAM! It's popping. Here. He's just breaking its neck. Poor phone. Poor phone, it didn't do anything wrong, it just did its job, delivering the message. Don't kill the messenger. Don't kill the messenger. I'm really curious how this is going to turn out like the sound. It can go in multiple directions. One of those I'm really scared of, I'll be completely honest. Because there's a certain way of making music within SM since a while that doesn't click with me like at all, like the exact opposite. This could, but it could also be really great. And I choose to trust Red Velvet, so I'll be positive. It's going to be one of those crazy ones again for Red Velvet. He's all over the place. Mm. Birthday. They definitely invaded here. They are not welcome for whatever reasons. Like imagine it's your birthday and Red Velvet is coming. I dare not to dream. I dare not to dream. Wait, what What was that around um, Wendy's neck here? Is that a bear? A bear neck? Wait. In the, I think in the other scene. Wait, 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 wait. Wendy, Wendy, Wendy. It is a bear. A little teddy bear. And as always, oh, earrings too. Okay. The beer theme is strong. Here she just has a jewel. And Ellie does. <laughs> what exactly are they playing here? This is a really strange field. Are these buildings from Seoul, guys? I don't know. I have no clue. But the sets here remind me a lot of like their Japanese stuff, their Japanese MVs. Like these, this way of building um, sets is really colorful, clean, simple um, way of building sets. Rather Festival 2022. By the way, I would be really interested in your guys' opinion on the way of naming the albums. Like this constant rather festival thing. Are you happy with it? Or do you think like... It's enough at this point? Because I'm not sure. On the one hand, I do like the... I do like the continuation of this... Of uh, like... Of this naming. On the other hand... I wouldn't be too mad about them dropping this. It's difficult. Really difficult. That I would love if they dropped this. The sleeping spell. 
Reminds a bit of Star Wars. These are not the druids you're looking for. No, we'd like this, right? These are not the druids you're looking for. No, I don't think they are related to, like, soul. Look at these palm trees here. Oh! And the Eiffel Tower! What a coincidence. I saw it just yesterday. I was standing in front of it just yesterday. Ha! <laughs> okay, we're most certainly not only in Seoul here. So we're going... Maybe it's all, like... Is it all capitals? That could be... Wait. Yeah, shit, I can't read the others. No, I can't read the others. But maybe we got, like, Paris, London, and stuff like this. That could be... Okay, let's watch it a few more times. But that, like, you gotta give the girls that, they are not killing. They're putting to sleep, beating in games, fair and square. They don't use their weapons at all. Like, it's not, they're not in the, like, peekaboo mode. <laughs> like, in the slaughtering mode. <laughs> I'm really curious to see what is going to happen in that music video. Okay, guys, let's watch it once more. One last time. Oh, wait a second, wait a second. I need to check out one thing here. Okay, no. For a second, I thought, um, I saw, only saw this lion uh, figure here. I thought, oh my god, SNSD. <laughs> you know, the Lionheart lion. But no, this is like the nightmare version of this lion. It, yeah, it's overall the nightmare version of every... F this is not one of the girls, right? Wait a second, the disco heads. Oh, yes, Mr. Scissorhands! He's here! Okay! I got an idea, I got an idea. So, they're all sitting here celebrating, and then he's getting the call. Maybe from the Cyclops dude. They're past the gates! They're past the gates! And then he's like, okay, take care of them. And then this dude is standing up. Maybe all of them. But a, now he, he's standing up and going um, to them. But it's, it is interesting that the disco ball girls, like disco ball people, are women. What if that's Red Velvet? If they're already here? That would be... That he wouldn't like at all. But this, this thing freaks me out. Like, this is the most, um, like, nightmare material there is. This psycho bunny here. <laughs> okay, guys! That was it. That was my little reaction to Red Velvet's birthday music video teaser. It looks really cool. I like the mix out of kind of adorable at times. The way they're always happy and smiling and jumping. Um, paired with this horror concept going on there. Um, I really can't wait to check out the rest of the MV to see you how all of this connects. And especially, of course, um, how the song will sound in the end. As I said, it could go in multiple directions. Um, a lot of them I'm really scared of, but in this house we trust um, Red Velvet. So let's see how all of this is going to turn out. I'm positive about it. Guys, let me know your opinions in the comments below. And I hope to see you next time. So next video is going to be. So thank you for your attention and bye.